Arthur, congratulations. A 2-0 Derby Day victory today against Newport and a clean sheet for yourself. Your reaction to the game? Uh, it was a difficult game with the conditions and uh, for me just being out for quite a while. Uh, but I think the team done really well today to, to push through and get the result. First of all, let's talk about your injury, a fractured jaw. How's the recovery been for you? No, it's been good um, from both sides, Arsenal and Wrexham. Uh, they helped me through the, the recovery process. I had surgery not, not too long ago. Um, but yeah, I was, as soon as my surgery finished, I was right back in uh, training and yeah, able to play today, which I'm really happy about. Being back around the building this week, how much of a lift does that give you when realistically be pretty lonely having that recovery time? How much of a lift was it to be back around the lads? No, it was really good. I think the lads uh, really uh, done well, uh, giving me a lot of uh, positivity as soon as I came back, as well as the, the gaffer and the other staff. Um, but yeah, it was really, really good coming back. I felt at home. Uh, yeah, it gave me confidence today to, to be able to play. And today you played under a protective mask. What's that like and how have you managed to adapt to that? I think you, you don't really ever adapt to it because you're not, you're not ever going to play with something on your face. But, um, you know, uh, Wrexham were really good to, to get me one made and being able to play with it today was, was weird, but I got used to it. You certainly did get used to it. Two outstanding saves in the first half, especially the one that you managed to tip onto the crossbar. Must have been a great feeling, especially in front of the, new, the fans behind the goal. Yeah, it's, it was a weird, weird uh, situation with the header at the front post. Um, but yeah, however I can help the team, it's always, it's always good for me and it's always a good feeling. Um, I think it's helped us to go along and win the game as well today. So yeah, I'm happy about it. With 12,000 fans inside the Stoke Kai Ras and behind you at the Cop End, what was that experience like having fans behind you at both ends? No, it was really good to see today the, the new Cop End. Um, I think we always needed fans there as well to push us. Um, but yeah, the fans are always great. Uh, I really enjoyed having them there today. It was a hard fought first half and then two goals after relentless pressure from JJ and Elliot to win the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I think we done really well. The game was quite slow. Um, <coughs> it would have been better without the, the rubbish conditions. Um, but yeah, we done well to stay in the game. It was a, lot, a, big, a big scrap. I think we, we, came, we came out really good. And a big three points to end what's been an excellent year for the club in 2023. How much are you looking forward to the next year to come? Ah, really excited. I think all the boys are excited. But yeah, we're not looking at the table at the moment, just going game by game, um, just enjoying our football. And yeah, I think you can see it when we play. Sometimes we're just taking things step by step. Thanks, Arthur. Congratulations. Thank you.